All right, so uh, this time around, we're going to be talking uh, once again about the BMW uh, E36, and we're going to be talking about O2 sensor locations. So if you look here, let me see if I can shine the light over here, get it in the proper spot. Um, on the front of your motor, on the passenger side, you're going to have two O2 sensors, one for each exhaust line. The first one is right there, and that's on the back side, uh, and you can see it's coated with oil, so that's the one I'm actually going to be replacing. I'm, I'm having smog issues right now, and um, I'm thinking that that's the O2 sensor that shot. And then on the other side we have, let me see if I can pull this up here, right about there, right there, that's the location for the first set of cylinder banks. So. Um, basically to get to these, you see, you can use a 22 millimeter wrench, I believe, uh, to get them out. Um, their locations are, let me go ahead and pull back up to the top here for the connections. The connections for these are, I'll grab my flashlight, you see a little better, uh, right there and right there. So those are your two locations for the front ones. Uh, there's two, two O2 sensors located on the back of the cat, and those are actually quite easy to get to. So, uh, But for now, we're going to go ahead and go with uh, replacing the front two, as uh, I believe they, they control the uh, NO emissions. The back one controls um, oxygen and CO2, um, or at least meters those. So um, considering that I'm feeling the smog on the 15 mile per hour, uh, NO emissions, I'm going to re be replacing one of these first, then a second one, and see. So, um, stay tuned guys, there'll be more on this shortly. Alright, so uh, I decided to go ahead and use the, the CarSoft software that I have uh, to read the computer. The check engine light came on, and uh, it threw up two codes, uh, 204 and 221. Now, I, I'm not too concerned about the 204 one, uh, but I'm more concerned about the 221. And what that is, is it says it's the Lambda... Uh, Bank 2 sensor 2, I believe it was, is what it was, uh, which means that uh, the Lambda is the uh, O2 sensor uh, on the BMW, and you have uh, the uh, the two up front and then the two behind the cat. So um, the one that I was actually looking at earlier, uh, which was oil covered, was actually the one that I needed to replace. So uh, my diagnostics on that was pretty good. Uh, the computer told me so as well. Uh, so now we're going to go ahead and switch over to uh, putting the O2 sensor in. Now, if you look at that, I've got the, the copper, um, uh, basically, uh, anti-seize on it. Uh, and what you want to do is you want to put it along the threads. Do not get it up along in here. It'll cause problems with the O2 sensor. So um, I'm going to go ahead and crawl up underneath the car, go ahead and replace this, reset the computer, and uh, things should be good. So um, hold on, guys, and I'll be right back.